Hello, my name's Linda. I'm an independent Stampin' Up! demonstrator and making a birthday card today. And it's going to be for the Creators Block Hop. The theme this month is birthdays. And so I'm going to be using um, the sieve textures and I'm also going to be using some of the framelits for that. The artisan textures and stitched all around. All I'm using or stitched all around is sentiment, so that could be coming from anywhere. We're going to start with this... Um, this sort of, I don't know what it is, but I'm using it as like bubbles. And I'm going to be using, um, I have a white card base. And then I've got um, Bermuda Bay, no, Coastal Cabana, sorry, the Coastal Cabana layer and a Whisper White layer on top. I'm going to be stamping on my Whisper White. And I'm going to start with that now. Just going to bring a bit of scrap paper in there. I'm going to stamp off and then stamp on so ink it up stamp it off and then stamp on I think that's enough. I've not actually made this card, so I'm winging it a little bit. I had an idea, and I'm going to try and put it together. Okay, so next, I'm going to be doing some more stamping, but this time I'm going to be bringing in my stamp apparatus, and I have the octopus here, and I want to I want to use some different colours on my octopus, and so I'm going to be using coastal cabana and soft sea foam so I'm going to start just by inking inking them up in soft sea foam and bring that over so I decided to bring in my ink refill for my coastal cabana and I'm just going to put a little bit on to one of the plastic mounts and then just using a piece of sponge I'm just going to sponge onto my onto my stamp. Bit of move that out of the way. And then bring it back down. And then I'm going to keep doing that until I get what I'm looking for. Okay, I'm quite happy with that and so I'm going to if I can find it I'm going to bring in my little embossing buddy just go over the top quickly and then I'm going to clean my um, stamp okay so now I've cleaned that and it's dry and I'm just inking it up with some um, Versamark push that over and now I'm going to take that off and we can move that out of the way and I'm going to be using some clear embossing powder and I'm just going to go over my octopus much of this left and now I'm just going to go over to my heat tool and I'm going to heat emboss that so I've heat embossed my octopus I don't know if you can see it's made him like a little bit shiny so he's got a bit of a wet look about him I'm just going to go over to my big shot and I'm going to um, use my frame lit to cut him out okay so I've cut him out and he's going to pop on here but before that I've cut some of the little um, dies out from the uh, from the sea of textures bundle. I've got a couple of bits of seaweed there, and I've got some of these. And I've cut one out in um, soft sea foam and one in whisper white. And then I've just swapped the little starfish over. And I was thinking of maybe having something going on down the bottom here, just a little bit of decoration down here. And I'm going to put some 
dimensionals on the back of this. So I've added my dimensionals to the back of my octopus and I've used a combination of the uh, mini mini dimensionals and the normal ones and I'm just going to pop him in the middle of my card there so he's waving around in the water and I'm going to bring in my best wishes sentiment and I'm going to ink that up I think I'm going to use black I'm going to just stamp my sentiment down the bottom there. So I'm just going to stick some of my seaweed or coral, this is, isn't it? Put some of my coral here and then some of my seaweed. I'm using my fine tip glue here. I'm just going to pop my little starfish on the top there. And then we can layer this up. Okay, so I'm going to bring some of these, these are the frosted and clear epoxy droplets and these are the frosted and these are the clear and I'm just going to pop a few of the clear randomly around my octopus so it just looks like some little bubbles. There we go. And then we can mount this onto the card base. Okay, and so there is my finished card, and because I decided I wasn't keen on the colour, I made another one. And this time I've used Knight of Navy and Bermuda Bay. So, option of two there, nice. I prefer this one, but this one's still okay. So, thanks for watching, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, and don't forget to hop along with the other creators on my blog hop. So go to description below and link onto my blog, and then you can hop along. Thanks for watching, bye.